Kind of like cardboard, huh? Gaze on. Hi, my name is Emma. And I'm Jen. And today, we're going to be doing a Trolls Gingerbread House. Yes, this is not a sponsored video. We have just seen Trolls merchandise everywhere. Yeah, like we, every we saw store. this and we were like, well, we gotta do it. Yeah, so I don't know, maybe this movie will be big. It, it looks really cute. So um, we saw this at, where did we see this at? Joanne's? Yeah, Joanne's. We saw this at Joanne's and it's a sugar cookie house. It's kind of like a gingerbread house and we love gingerbread house kits if you've watched our channel at all you would know that we do gingerbread houses pretty much at every every holiday we get, like, like if Halloween. we see a gingerbread house out in the wild we're gonna be like let's do it we do Thanksgiving one for gingerbread house let's do it <laughs> one for Christmas yeah. and now we're gonna do one for the trolls movie and this one looks really cool because it's all very colorful and you it's get got a different um, shape than it's, usual it's got a different shape and it also comes with like wow. uh, edible watercolors you can paint it so that's pretty cool oh and we're wearing these they're leg warmers. Yeah, we made them for um, the makeup tutorial. No, no. Makeup tutorial and challenge. We made it for the challenge video. I don't know at what sequence this video will go up. So let's get started. Okay, so um, what so comes in the, hold on, let's talk about what it comes in the kit. It comes with pre-baked cookie, pre-baked sugar cookie pieces, ready to use white icing, edible watercolors, gumdrops, cupcake candies, paper pieces, plastic, Drains? I don't know. House base and piping bag. Plastic stand. Plastic stand. So you can stand a little Oh, here. plastic stand. Plastic. My, these are these uh, lights are blinding me, so I cannot read right now. Here are the pieces. All oh, these are really cute little um, cupcake sprinkles. This must be the watercolor palette thing. Uh, this is icing. Oh, those look. That looks delicious. It smells good. Let's not ruin this cookie. And a little smell it. Oh, that smells good. You're supposed to carefully remove the cookie pieces from the packaging and lay them on a flat sur surface with smooth sides of cookie facing up. You're supposed to knead the icing pouch for one minute to a soft, smooth consistency. It says adults do that, but who cares? Now. We're supposed to snip the tip of the icing pouch to a one fourth inch opening. Squeeze half of the icing pouch into a small bowl. This will be used to decorate the house. Set aside the remaining pouched icing to assemble the house later. Okay, so we're supposed to put this in a bowl. It smells great, it tastes great. And add one and one half teaspoons of water. Okay. What if I lick it? Should that. we do our own side? Do you want your own side? No. You want to make this into a challenge? You have to line vote line. whose side does the best. You don't want to do it. Okay, so we're just going to estimate here. We got one teaspoon and a half. And take the remaining pouch icing to assemble the house later. Okay, so now what you're supposed to do is cut a small little hole in the tip like so and then you use this to decorate your pieces it's difficult it's more difficult than what you would expect mine didn't work suffering. out suffering They are very rare and very poisonous. Oh, oh no. Oh no. My whole thing is ruined now. Just well, kidding. Yeah. <laughs> We have finished icing them. We are going to let them sit overnight. And once they're dry, we're going to paint them and decorate them. So see you tomorrow. 
All right, so we're back. It is the next day and our icing has fully dried and hardened. And now we're going to decorate it and paint it. Yes, we have to wait for it to dry in order to paint it. And these are the um, edible watercolors, I think is what they are. Mm -hmm. And um, they look like a piece of paper. Well, yes, they are a piece of paper each and each. And it's like a little palette. Whoa. See? Whoa, look at that. And um, we're just gonna paint our houses now. So I'm gonna put frosting in here, put the front in, and then put frosting on the side and put the side in. And also put frosting on like the side of the house to make sure it sticks. Am I the front? I think that doesn't matter. Yeah. My side is very nice. It has really random swirls all over the place. Lots of dots, a really fancy door, some grass, um, stripes. This side is a really put together, pristine, clean side. It's very perfect. There are no messes to be found here. Lines at the bottom, lots of weird little dots. And whatever these are, I have. Whatever these are, I have no idea what they are, but they look very artistic. We have three beautiful hearts at the top with three beautiful cupcakes as well and some dots. We have a door with some yummy candy drop accents. And then we've got some colorful mountains back here. And then on this side of the house, we have a beautiful rainbow and a wonderful rainbow colored droppings at the top and cupcakes lining the side and some candy dots. And then the most beautiful part of the entire house, I must say, is this right here, which is the beautiful swirling cloud with the beautiful sugary rainbow. We have finished it, and mine is obviously the best gingerbread house anyone will ever see. So make sure you vote in the card of whose gingerbread sides you like the best, and we hope you enjoyed this video, and we're really looking forward to the Trolls video. We hope we have time to watch it while video? we're on vacation. Movie. Movie. Micah. We go on vacation tomorrow. Fun. We hope you City. enjoyed watching it, so thank you for watching. Please comment, share, subscribe. That's Micah. Thumbs up, follow us on Twitter, and bye YouTube. Bye YouTube.